Hello, this is Dennis Johnson, and this exercise is from volume two, and it is exercise number 14, which I'm calling episode number 14, and it's entitled uh, 16th Note Accent Grid. And we're actually going to play this uh, backwards for number 15, but uh, 14 is the, uh, the basic exercise taking 16th notes and placing accents on different partials. So you've got four sixteenth notes. You're going to put an accent on one, an accent on two, an accent on three, an accent on four. So only one, the E, the AN, and the UH uh, for different durations. So the first, basically the first uh, part of this is putting, putting the, placing the accent on uh, the downbeat. So we're going, okay. Uh, accents up around 12 inches, taps down around three. So we've got, all right? And then the second measure, we're putting the, placing the accent on the E, all right? And then on the uh, or the upbeat. And on the uh, one E and uh. Okay, so the first part of this exercise is just basically placing an accent on every partial of the 16th notes in a four count pattern. Okay, and the underlying propulsion for this exercise is just the barrage of sixteenths down here at uh, tap height. All right, so we're gonna play this slowly, uh, but of course you'll want to speed this up, uh, and then in the future, the next episode, ex episode fifteen, we'll be playing it backwards, uh, and then we we morph into a two count figure of that. So we're gonna go. We're going to do that twice, all right? And then the uh, last part of this three-part exercise is playing one count of every partial being accented. So we're going... And we do that four times. Um, a lot of young players will rush the transition between the repeats, uh, basically going from the four... To the one, so they'll play. So we don't want that. We want to use a metronome and set the uh, subdivision to sixteenth notes. So, uh, without further ado, I'll put the metronome on one ten, and I'll play this sixteenth note uh, accent grid. Uh, you can put diddles on the accents. You can put flams on the accents. You can put cheeses, which is basically a flam with a diddle on it, uh, on the accents later on. Uh, but let's not get ahead of ourselves. This is the 16th note accent grid played at 110. Uh, and if you get the music, it's an A, a B, and a C section. All right, so here we go. Okay, so that is number 14. Stay tuned for number 15. And don't practice until you can get this right. Practice until you can, cannot get it wrong. All right, lots of reps. Play it to your favorite piece of music. Play it to a metronome, by all means. And stay tuned for episode number 15 in volume two. And keep on drumming. <laughs>